Hello everyone, Eric Lee here. This is my YouTube vlog and my secondary channel in which my sentimental thoughts come from my heart and my soul. And where my mental oddball shenanigans come from my mind and brain. This is EML77 TV episode uh, 146 was going on. I want to talk about this because this is totally crazy. Um, this is about Sebastian Bach of the lead singer Sid Skid Row of the 80s and 90s versus Fozzie Lee singer Chris Jericho, a.k.a. Le Champion, a.k.a. former AEW World Heavyweight Champion, former WWE Superstar, Chris Jericho. Um, <laughs> and this is... um. This is, this is a crazy feud. This is crazy. I never thought this would happen. So Travis, at Travis, I'm here on Twitter. At Travis Drago, Travis Walsh, says that Chris Jericho starts to look like Sebastian Bach. And I'm talking about last night's AEW episode. And Sebastian Bach responds, every single day for the last two or three years, somebody tells me this. And at Captain Howdy 95, said, you party too much, Jericho has you beat. Sebastian Bach tweets, he definitely does something it does considering he mimes to a tape. He's questioning Jericho's singing ability. So I decided, well, I don't want to be mean to Sebastian Bach because he is a rock legend. So I have decided to say, I'm like, uh oh, you don't want to go there, man. Because you're talking about a, a Russell who could sing. You know, Chris Jericho's a talented singer. Also, he can wrestle too. So like, I'm like, uh oh, you do not want to go there, man. And, uh, I did the uh, meme of Chris Jericho circa WWE. You just made the list, as you can see here. And <laughs> Sebastian Bach, I'm surprised he even responded to me, which is really, was really cool. I'm honored about that. I said, yeah, I started a television show called A List on VH1 about 15 years before you posted his meme. Okay. Now, <laughs> some guys were being rude to him and everything else. And um, some people were defending Jericho. And, uh, you know, some people, and, and then at Chris Winness, uh, Widness, you were literally the first person to ever do a list. I can't think of anyone else who would ever jokingly refer to their bad list. He definitely stole this idea directly from you. I went, not the same list, gentlemen, is not the same list. Although Kenneth Glantz, case, um, uh, at KM McAwesome said the list started and in, in 1999, Chris Jericho's first list of 1,004 holds was March 13, 1998. Jericho wins again, and I posted my usual bullseye. Boom. Now, what? Now, how did Jericho respond to this? Now, him and Jericho were once friends. So I'm going to Jericho's Twitter account right now, as you know. And, uh, <laughs> you know, Chris Jericho... Uh, I, unbelievable. He and he and he goes, you know, you know, you know. He goes. I have never mind anything ever. I don't use star in a tweet ever. I will bleep and sing in your face at any time, any place, dude. I've been a fan of Defender of You since day one, but don't you ever question my rock abilities. And leave wrestling out of this. I can hit a G four bra. And uh, and it's Sebastian Bach. Uh, this is like you know, this is where's the derogatory comment? All I ask is to see one single clip of you singing live. Every clip on the internet is you miming to a tape. You we go. I warned him. I didn't warn him. I was singing a bleeping face anytime. Wrestling's not rock and roll. I will show you effing rock and roll. Oh uh, boy, you know. But this is how he goes. I see the derogatory comments towards me from somebody I, I consider to be a friend. So with that in mind, I'll be happy to have a sing-off with Sebastian Bach. At Sebastian Bach. No effects, no tuning, no no BS. Bass is a great singer, but I am better. Uh, Sebastian, you got my number, dude. Call me. Oh, boy. And let's see. And how did I respond to that, you know? <laughs> oh my gosh. Hi, I'm Chris Milli Vanilli Jericho. I have top five top 30 singles in the last five years of my band, Fozzy Rock. 
I'm a huge fan of Sebastian Buck, who had top 30 singles 30 years ago. I always married a single in front, and I still do. It's just cool to see a clip of that, because I every single clip is seen as Millie Vanilli. Wow! Okay, gloves are off. You, you starred along with, five, along with 59 other people. Let's stop this now. I warned him. I def. I warned. I warned Sebastian Bach this was going to happen. I warned him. I freaking warned him. <laughs> I warned Sebastian Bach. I warned him that this was going to happen. Does he? And he keeps going with this thing. I, I warned Sebastian Bach. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe. And this is. <laughs> My goodness. Oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'm telling you. I warned Sebastian Bach you don't want to go there with Jericho. And he went there. I warned him. I warned Sebastian Bach. I said, dude, don't, don't, don't go there, dude. He, and, you know, I told him. And let me go back to my page for just a second. And this is what, this is how I responded. You know, this is how I responded. Let, let's, uh. That's how I responded. That's, um, okay, see, that's how I want. You full, you know. He says you're full of you're full of bleep, bro. Check your tests. Seven single. I'm ready when you are. And I go. I warned you, man. I warned you. I warned you. I warned you, Sebastian Bach. You don't go there with Jericho, dude. Trust me. You know, I warned. I totally warned him. I warned Sebastian Bach. Don't go there with Jericho. Do not question his abilities. Whether it be singing or wrestling, don't question Chris Jericho. Oh, my gosh. You question Chris Jericho, you're going to be a stupid idiot. You're going to make the list. And that's and it ain't going to be the list on VH1 that you were talking about, Sebastian. It's a different list. And Jericho will, uh, you know, Jericho knows what I'm talking about. I know what Jericho, you know. So Jericho knows why I'm not dissing Jericho. I warned you. I said, dude, you do want to go there with him. You do not want to go there, man. You do not want to go there. And I, but the bleep, you just made the list. And dude, you don't want to go. You don't want to go there. Dude, you just did not want to. You just went there, Chris Sebastian Bach. Listen, dude, yeah, I know you're an awesome rocker back in the day, dude. But Jericho's on a different, a rocker on a whole different level, man. You know, I just, I, you know, just, you know, you don't want to. It's. You don't want to go there. You did not. Well, you do not want to go there. You went there. Told you. I won't. Told you. Told you. See, 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 see. See. I told you. See. Told you. See. Told you. I told you. I told you, Sebastian Bach. You don't go there with Jericho. Jericho's got enough on his plate. He had to deal with Orange Cassidy, who dumped orange juice on the guy on, on him and his crew last night. The inner circle. Now he's got to deal with you. You guys are friends. Oh, my goodness. Sebastian Buck, what was you thinking, bro? I told you. I told him. I told Sebastian Buck. I warned him. I said, dude, you don't want to go there with him. I told you. I told him. This is what happens. Bro. Sebastian Buck, bro. Dude, what happened? What happened? And you're trending. Yeah. You know why, dude? I warned Sebastian. I warned him not to go there with Jericho. He went there. This is what happens. This is what happens when you go there with Chris Jericho. You don't question the guy's singing ability, dude. Oh, my gosh, Sebastian Bach. What was you thinking, bro? What was you thinking, dude? Oh, God bless you, Sebastian Bach. Seriously, man. You see, I felt like I've been put on this earth to deal with the crazy people. And just, I, <laughs> I'm telling you, this is, this is ridiculous. I mean, Sebastian Bach versus Chris Jericho. In a, in a sing-off, hey, I'm all for it. I know both men can sing, but I'll tell you one thing. Chris Jericho is on a different level, man, of rock and roll. I mean, yeah, listen, I, <laughs> I love it. I just, you don't go there with Jericho. You don't. You don't go there with Jericho, Sebastian Bach. Dude. Dude, I know you guys are friends, but don't question him anymore. Don't question him anymore. I know, I know probably, you know, maybe it will start off as all in fun and all of a sudden, boom, it goes out of control. And you're questioning his singing abilities? Come on. I don't know if Sebastian was drunk when he said, I don't know. I really don't know because I'm not going to judge the guy. 
So I, I didn't want to make fun of Sebastian Bach. I just was like, I'm just like, mate, you don't want to go there, man. I'm just saying, you don't want to go there with him. You know, you don't want to go there. Just, and they went to the year before you made that meme. I made that meme. Oh my goodness, praise the Lord. I'm like, God. So I, I warned him. I warned him. See, told you. Warned him. I warned you, Sebastian Bach. I warned you not to go there with Jericho, and you went there. You went there. Now you got to face the music. Figuratively and literally. <laughs> I got to see what happens here. I got to see. I got to see what happens afterwards. This is going to be great. At least you're trending, my man. At least you're trending. So uh, I don't care about your political preferences, but but you versus Jericho, whew, ee, off the window, man. It's going to be crazy, man. It's going to be crazy. So that's all the time we have. And uh, see, told you. <laughs> That's, I figured I would talk a little bit about that. So uh, I'll see you guys later. You guys have a wonderful day. And uh, I want to try that invisible, uh, incredible box thing again. See if I, I see if I can know what I did wrong. And I'm gonna, and this time I'm gonna review review the video and, and then I'm gonna upload it my before I upload it on YouTube. All right. I'll see you guys later. You guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you in episode 747. Bye.